All right, see you, little hand. Um, so, uh, five five ten game. Um, Rock, I believe, is a middle position. Okay. Uh, first guy who enters the pot makes a mini raise to twenty. Right. Um, gets three callers. Uh, I call with ace ten eight five with uh, ace ten of clubs. Okay. Uh, kind of a loose call, but I got a nut suit. Whatever. I don't think that's a loose um, call. I think that's a fine call. Yeah. So, anyways, um, it's five handed of the pot, a hundred dollars in the pot. Right. Um, I am second to act. Flop comes queen eight eight with two clubs. So right. I flop trips ace kicker with a uh, nut flush draw. Right. First act checks. Um, I bet 80 into 100. Right. Um, two guys behind me fold. Button with the short stack. I think he had 240. Right. He just ships it in. Right. Um, and then the guy to my right, he thinks about it for a little bit, thinks about it for a while, and then just flat calls. So in this spot, should I be uh, he's got 600 behind after the 240? I have him covered. Right. Um, should I be raising him in that spot, or should I just be flatting there? Uh, I, I'm thinking maybe neither. <laughs> uh, you have trips and a nut flush draw, right? Right. Um, I think you're in. Pretty, folding. I think you're in pretty bad shape right here, unless you can tell me something about the guy who moved in and something about the flatter that makes me think that you know they have like they're missing a chromosome or something. Oh right. So the guy, the guy who moved in, he was 250. He had like a thousand, a couple hands before, so he was pretty tilted. Okay. And um, the guy to my right. Um, I really knew nothing about. He was a quote unquote gypsy. Okay. Um, <laughs> um, and um, hadn't really been, um, he, he'd maybe been in the game for about an orbit, and I haven't really seen him do really much of anything. Mm -hmm. But n nothing really indicated to me that he was a good player at all. Um, well, here's so, yeah, a, that, those, those are my only reads in the opponents. Basically, here's the problem the problem is. The, even the gypsy guy, even though, you know, there could be a lot of things going on in his mind. One of the things that's definitely going on in his mind is that you still have open action behind him. Okay. Right. And, um, and losing, uh, and you could pre basically not even pot it and put him all in. <laughs> and, uh, that's just not a place where people, even people that aren't good, are light. Uh, the light is, the, I mean, you're basically dreaming in this spot that he has an, just an 8-2. Yeah, that's, that's, I'd, I'd put him on just an 8. That's your best case scenario. But if he has 8-queen or queen-queen, he's basically going to play it the same way. The nuts are still in his range. And the guy who shipped in, yeah... He's really probably wide if he's only got a little bit left. But you still got to think, like, he shipped in with a lot of people left to act, a couple people left to act, and you with open action. The worst hand he's going to probably show up there with is, like, aces. But he wasn't the pre-flop pre raiser. Okay? No. So I, I don't think it's going to be aces. It could be kings. Um, is the worst hand he's going to show up with, like, kings with a flesh draw? But if he has an eight, which he may well have because the, it went five ways. Everybody who plays PLO understands that when it goes five ways, something huge is out there, right? Uh, five, right. P, five PLO hands is 30 hold'em hands. It's 30 hold'em hands. Uh, so I think for me, unless, I mean, for me not having any reads, it's actually sort of a, a meh fold. It's not a fist pump fold, but it's a fold. I mean, you only have one over if you're wrong, and he has an eight with a queen. Or And if he has queen, queen, you're just drawing dead. Uh, and you're in against two hands that have shown tremendous interest in the pot. And without, like, a side read that they're missing chromosomes or something, I think that's a, I think that's a sort of a... Yeah, my life sucks, but I fold. For me, it is. Right. Now you're gonna so tell. I, now you're gonna tell I'm me gonna that. I'm gonna tell you I fucked it up. <laughs> oh, oh, what did you do? Well, um, so I I made a really bad read on the on the gypsy guy, and I just put him on a naked eight, something like you know, 
Jack Nine Eight Seven, whatever, right. something like that. Right. Put him on a Naked Eight, and I figured, I figured with Queen Queen, he's popping me back a hundred percent of the time. Which I don't think is he is popping you. I don't he's think not. he is popping yeah. you back hundred. I think you, yeah, I think that you misranged the, time, the situation. That's what I thought, okay. Yeah. yeah, and I figured, I figured a lot of times he he just has Ace Eight there. Right. Um, and um, I'm free rolling him basically with the nut flush draw, so I made a really bad raid and just said fuck it all in and then right. he uh he called and he had queen eight and yeah. he won well hey that's why you call me i knew what he had <laughs> yeah exactly listen well, that's why if, if, if i was right and i won the hand i wouldn't be calling about this man well i don't i didn't know if he won the hand or not i mean you know you know yeah. i don't know but i mean i'm just telling you that like uh if you would have told me that you won the hand i would have still said it was a bad play <laughs> you know right. in a nutshell you're ranging these guys. It's pot limit Omaha. It goes to the flop five ways. That's 30 hold of hands. There's going to be some good shit out there, okay? Uh, so you can't just immediately say the guy who makes it 240 has nothing. The worst thing you're ever going to... The, the, the only hand you're, that he's ever going to show you, really, that you like is King King with clubs. That's the only hand he can show you like. Everything else you're not going to like from him. Then the guy, when the guy flats, knowing that you can come back over the top, knowing that you jammed into fucking five fucking people, when he flats, he's basically announcing that he has a hand that he loves, like love, 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 loves. So when you think of the hands that he love, 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 loves, two of them got you completely fucked, and the rest of them you're just flipping with. That's if the guy who already put in 250 doesn't really have it. So the fold there, you know, like I said, it sucks to make trips. You're not going to be fucking overly happy about it, but it's a fold all day. All right? Right. Right. All right, JT. Thanks, all right. brother. All right. Well, thanks. Yeah. Thanks for calling it. Call in any time with a PLO hand. I like it. All right. As all long right. as I, as long as I get it right and I do, and I read the hand right, I'm happy. <laughs> okay. I'll try to find one that you don't read right and then hopefully it'll make for an entertaining show. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> all right. Bye. Peace. Uh...